What's up cunts, it's your favorite 21 year old crackhead Cliggy Yo Niggy here back with a new smacker. Today's new hot lesson is how to lie and be a hypocrite like our favorite person ever, Jared William and his hot want to be street crew, cannibals. First, let's dive into his claim that he doesn't associate with pedos. Quite funny to claim such a thing while being not only allied with a pedo club who takes pictures of a minor's willy, but then also be one yourself. Why not go ask Manny the president of Legion about that time he took a picture of Joel, also known as Bobby Thunderbuns Willie when Joel was 17? Quite funny how you don't associate with pedos don't you think? This is a picture right after Legion took a picture of his Willie. Look how sad he is, for only pennies a day you could help this poor Joel recover. Uh oh, looks like there is a breaking news story about the terrible people at AAMC. <laughs> What's up, Drama Alert Nation? I'm your host, Big Nigga Dan. AAMC has been called out for a pedophile allegation. We have our on-site man here to talk with some of the AAMC members to see what they have to say. Thanks, Nigga Dan. Over here we have some local AAMC members. Let's see how they feel about these allegations. <laughs> well, it seems here they don't give a flying fuck. What an informative news story. Now then, sweethearts, hot topic number two. Supposedly, our lovely friends at Cannibals tried so hard to have a rumble with the AAMC people, but yet when we gave them amazing options like Scrap House or Dojo, the most amazing places in the world. They just wouldn't do it and claimed we just weren't cooperating with them, even though we gave them places to choose in a week of time to decide. They claimed they wanted a neutral place to have a sweet rumble at the bonking grounds. How funny that our allies and members have been banned there before, but I guess as as always with the cannibals it only applies when it's them that is being affected. How? Funny that last second the nerds at Legion and Cannibals decided to instead of having the agreed upon shootout with SSMC using the items that were agreed upon. Instead they would try and have some silly rumble last second at bonking grounds so they can try to claim an auto win like losers always do. Now sweeties, on to our third sexy part. According to Jared Smellium he was sent to talk with me and our conversation never happened. Quite funny that cute little lie. We never talked about it even though I bullied him and his helper out of call multiple times. And when I talked about our sweet rumble he never actually wanted to talk about it. Instead just complain about how we wouldn't go to bonking grounds. And when I told him that he was given his options of where we were going to do it he'd just cry like he always does. But as is always the case with him, lie about it so that he feels better. Also kinda funny. That us cooperating and deciding a rumble a time became him crying to some nerd to set one up and expect us to go along with it. Kinda like as if he never had any intention of doing what he claims he was gonna. More sweet stuff is his claim that he whoops AAMC's asses at the dojo. Kinda funny and at that every time they show up we beat their asses for hours with hot videos on it and them running out of the ring to heal like little bitches. They also claim that we have them kicked for whooping our asses but yet no proof to back up their claim. Please do send me some proof of an AAMC member asking for a CMC member to be banned. I'll be waiting here for you to back up your claims. They also claim that AAMC members have admin at Dojo. Which ones are they? Also will be waiting on proof for that. Another cute thing is that we ping our members when fights are going on trying to claim that we need help for these fights. Whoever knew that informing your members of a fight going on is a cry for help. Now for a terrible thing that no one in the community ever knew about until Jared valiantly told everyone. The mean man known as Otis O'Reilly sends shit porn to people. What terrible news I know. No one ever knew this until now. Oh wait, I just remembered that's been common knowledge in the community since 2013. Also what a pussy bitch not naming sources. Kind of funny saying you won't sweep pedo allegations under the rug, but when you and your allies are accused of the same thing it's magically swept away. Kinda cute am I right? And for my final little treat before the dessert, you nerds should use a better editing software. Windows Movie Maker and PowerPoint only makes people snore. Now on to our dessert for the sweet people out there, and especially for Jared Smellium. Enjoy.
Look at this dude. <laughs> Wait till you see the. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Four O Nerds.